What is going on, Punkin Nation, and welcome back. And today, haven't done one of these videos in a very long time. We are doing a channel update video. I don't know if you guys ever heard, but 2020 was going to be my shakeup year. So, I've been hinting a lot and been taking out the haters for the last about good year. So, if you throw my friend to this point, uh, you are definitely a keeper. I have ended quite a bit of rela uh, friendships here in the last couple months. Uh, to those people in particular, sorry, but not sorry, um... I got some new rules that I am definitely following and keeping myself safe and you guys also safe from the drama. I did end my five, about four year uh, friendship with Lambo Mods. I want to definitely get into the backstory about that. So I was seeing that whatever I did affected him and... I didn't really like that. I didn't want him to get hurt. So that was one of my decisions. And then later on, so that was probably, what did it, yeah, that was about a month ago. So then it got to a point where I started to rough some feathers with Garrett Plays. Wasn't really trying to. I was trying to give him instructional feedback. He is a 17-year-old. Yeah, I respect all the 17-year-olds basically anybody below 18 i try to respect you as long as possible if you start getting off the plank we definitely have some issues so what you guys need to understand is this is the real world I'm not going to really explain I'm not going to get into it so it's bittersweet uh, i was supposed to help him or this is lambo supposed to help him with the website um I guess I can show you those videos. They're stashed up in here. I will respect those videos, but for further go, I'm not going to do anything with his website. Honestly, I crunched the numbers, saw if I actually had time to do it. I could swain it, but it wasn't going to be worth my time. So there's the Oshkosh. The Hummer, the Ambulance is on CW's channel. We try to incorporate Low Boy and CW into this. It was going to be a really fun expedition. And we were just going to just crank out videos of whatever he made. He was a great guy. He just, um, one of my issues that I've come into is, where do I get all my stress? And I'm sure you guys can answer this right off the bat. Anybody under 18 years old, I'm 23. So I've said to myself, doesn't matter the age of the person. So for Lambo, he's in his 30s. And he is hanging around people under 18. I respect 18-year-olds to a certain point or anybody underneath. So when I have an issue with them, I respect the person hanging out with them to feel out my concerns. And my concerns were... I didn't care for Garrett plays being with us I know they have their little chancel channel sponsor but at the end of the day if you can't be nice to everybody else I was not being mean at all like maybe the first one but then we kind of made up so the second one it was just simply commenting on what he said about a particular mod that was in the makings and all it was is like ah you're looking for views you death I didn't really say desperate but that's the leaning towards I was leaning towards we're all in this together or we were when I was in the Lambo mods crew so I don't know why he needed to feel to say that obviously he's very anal about his views which I get it he's still trying to make a business out of this but you don't need to be a crybaby but on your big boy panties and man up you guys seen me I don't take shit anymore I don't really care so you acting like it let's put it this way if comments ever come like that don't react to them because reacting to them is gonna hurt you more than the comments actually coming towards you look at the squad he gets daily hate does he respond to him no so that means he stays on track and that is how you protect your business 
think about it. Does UPS respond to all those haters that hate UPS? No. They just keep on going. They keep doing what they do. So when you respond to the hate, you will drive your business down yourself. That's the big kicker. So you guys don't see me respond to hate. I try not to, but there's certain ones I do. Most of it, you guys don't even see behind the scenes. Comment in my comments. Anything I don't like, I'm going to use him as an example. Remove. Boom. I know who that is. I already talked to him. So, when you respond to comments, you're putting yourself down. I love where my channel is. I don't care if I'm making $23 a month. It does not really matter. I'm doing this, this as a side hobby. Plus, whatever cash I make, it goes right back to you guys. That 3D printer, yeah. That 3D printer, I don't know if you guys seen it. Uh, let me see where I post it. That $1,500 came straight from YouTube. Within the last five years, I've made over $3,500. And I'm being honest. Let me see. Did I post it here? Um, I don't think I did, but I think it's in Backstreet Boys. It's uh, called the Snapmaker. It's a three-in-one machine. Personally, if I was if I was going, uh, this is before I bought the printer. I said to myself, if I'm gonna spend a thousand dollars, I'm not just gonna buy simply a printer, a 3D printer that just prints plastic. This one does three-in-one. It does uh, plastic, CNC which is, I believe I can do leather work, wood, I can do laser. So that's worth the 1500 bucks I spent. Now it's on sale currently because it's in a, pay, or a Kickstarter. So it will eventually go, I got the 350, which is the top guy. It'll eventually go to $1,800. So I figured you saved $480. So... I'm using my money wisely, but I don't have very much. So think about it in my shoes, Garrett plays, or the squad, or anybody that's way the fuck up there. Think about it. You can come simply back down to where I'm at. So don't try to be that, oh, I'm a big shot. I need to make sure that you're known as a hater. It's just not going to work. So... This is a lesson learned. I'm very thankful that I ended the friendship with Lambo Mods. I think it was the right choice. I expressed my concerns, gave them 24 hours to think about it, and I just said, I'm not dealing with this crap anymore. I know Winston's on the fence too, and I hope for I hope for the best. So, you know, he's at the same age too. So at the end of the day, it's what you want. It's what you want to put up with. I'm not going to listen to anybody. What I have to put up with, the only thing I'm going to put up with is family and the job of UPS. So that is a quick update video. I told you guys I'm shaking up my life. I'm doing a lot of different stuff. I'm doing a lot of personal stuff. Uh, let's see, maybe a different job could be in the future. So, it depends what I want to do there. Uh, once I buy my truck, I may shape up to a different bank. I have a lot of personal stuff. I make milestones in my life. Don't want to be doing the same exact thing for the rest of my life. So, I hope you guys can respect that. Uh, really nice content coming. Obviously, the Patreon videos will come to an end. Uh, if you guys know a better Patreon out there, or somebody different, let me know in the comments below. Lambo Mods, you really had an excellent Patreon. I will have to give you that. A plus to the moon and back, man. You didn't rip anybody off, but you, you hang out with the wrong people. So that's the reason why I left totally. So, and also I do want to protect you in your business. I don't want to see you fail just because of my actions. People thought that I was a big asset, and I kind of was, but I don't want to be uh, hurting your business F as I'm trying to take care of some of these people in this god-awful community. 
So that's mainly the reason I left, but the tip of the iceberg was definitely the situation that just happened. So thank you guys so much for watching. Nice channel update video. Um, more things to come from Low Boy, CW, Alfie. You know, we're still going to go business as planned. We're just discontinuing a, an awesome series that we had with Patreon mods. Do I still support Patreon mods? Hell yeah. You know, I just don't agree with certain people. So, Lambo Mods is doing the right thing by giving at least 10 per month. You're not going to find anything like that else in the Patreon community. So, please still support him. I will still endorse him, but I'm just going to have to wait for public ones. So, it's whatever, I guess. No hate to his business. It's just that he uh, definitely should think about who he hangs out with. Well, that's it for today guys thank you guys so much for watching if you want to know any more information about what i'm doing to shake up my life put it down in the comments below i would be glad to let you know and see where you stand we are still going we got snow runner we're going to be doing satisfied factory i would love for you guys to check out that those videos i'm having a big dilemma with farming simulator and here's my reason i can run snow runner on ultra I can run satisfied factory on ultra I can run every other game on ultra except farming simulator so I don't think it's my computer I don't think it could be so I'm having some problems so bear with me farming simulator may slow down for a little while but I think let's take a break so we got plenty of time for the mowing season we are definitely plenty early on the mowing season. We got off to a really good start. I'm thinking of some more ATS because of the uh, pandemic and everybody just staying home. We'll do some longer videos with ATS. The mod spotlights on Satisfied Factory will keep going. The upgrades, I have a ton of things to show you guys on Satisfied Factory. We got a rooftop garden. We have a third level to the UPS facility. I'm still cranking out. And we got renewable energy. So we're going to turn the entire map. In, and it's going to all it's gonna be ran on wind power, guys. No more coal. Let's go green. So we can, we're not even going to probably do um, nuclear. We might do nuclear in the, in the future, but... Let's make a green factory. I hope to see you guys there. Thank you for sticking around for the last five years. I really appreciate it. Even though we're not going to hit 10,000 subscribers anytime soon, you guys are the best. In my heart, we already hit 10,000 subscribers a long time ago because you guys are the freaking best. Keep going. Keep pushing that like button. If you ever want to talk to me, I'm in Discord. If you have some issues with me, Please talk to me in my Discord because I want to make a better life in YouTube. No more drama from here on out, please. If you have an issue, talk it like a man in Discord. I'm in Discord every single day between the hours of 9 a.m. to 4 p.m. Central Time. On the weekends, pretty much all day. So, if I'm not out of town... So, that's where you'll find me if you want to be man-to-man -man instead of doing all this little drama bullshit. We'll see you guys later. Have a great night. Stay calm. I know this, uh, I, I think this quarantine session is definitely getting to my head. But trust me, I thought it out with Lambo Mods. I gave him the choice. He decided to pick towards Garrett Place, and I didn't appreciate it. He blamed me for everything. So, see you guys later.